Hey guys, Kevin Beasley from New Start Realty and Relocation here in uh, Surprise. I'm out in Sun City today with the guys and uh, uh, we're loading up for Sun City West. Now, yesterday I did a live feed on, um, on a recent scam that's going on with uh, APS. And I want to kind of re, um, redo that because I could not share that live feed onto my uh, other business pages and so on FB. So um, I kind of wanted to redo it and then because something else was kind of added to it. Anyway, if you guys seen that video um, yesterday, that was December 1, 2017, I get this call from uh, a person claiming to be from APS and they threatened to uh, cut off my uh, if I didn't make payment immediately they were going to cut off my um, power and um, apparently they uh, targeted realtors because um, there's another realtor um, friend of mine who also posted about the same thing that happened to her and also um, there was actually two realtor friends who posted and what's weird is we are all three together uh, on a Google search and uh, we're all within uh, uh, 10 spots so that was kind of weird um, there was uh, three things that, that uh, sent up uh, a red flag for me um, so I, um, oh, oh guys I forgot to mention it was particularly odd about this is when they called me they called me from the APS um, phone number the 7171 number and um, it was in my caller ID because I use it for turn on and turn offs for my uh, real estate company and so that's what was particularly weird, how they were ghosting that phone number over to their own. Um, the three things that, the red flags that, um, that I noticed was that uh, the first one was they, it was, and I don't want to be racially profiling or nothing, but it was a, uh, a Middle Eastern accent around um, the uh, Northern India part. Um, and, and I know that APS doesn't outsource that type of uh, 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 collections. They do it locally. And the second red flag was they threatened to cut off the power within 25 minutes. Now we know APS, if you're going to cut off, they give you a better notice than that. And uh, in fact, I don't think they call you. I think they just tag your house. And the third red flag was he identified it as my uh, real estate company and not me and the of course my I work out of my house so my electricity bill is comes to Kevin Beasley not New Start Realty and so I called uh, APS and uh, they verified that I had a zero balance with them but uh, the scammers will give you an 800 number to call and that's where when they get your credit card that's um, uh, where they're gonna get you at now what's particularly weird too was and I may not and I may be just a little paranoid but that same day I get a call from Solar City and I, I missed the call but the voicemail said we have an urgent matter to discuss with you and what's kind of bothering me is Two weeks ago, I got another call. Now, I tried to call Solar City, and but they got so many calls coming in right now that I couldn't even get through. Um, so I left them a message to call me. I've, I've tried to call them twice, and it's just not happening. I can't get through. Um, and because two weeks ago I paid them 170 bucks and now they're calling me up hitting me up for some more money so with all this scamming going on no doubt I'm a little bit paranoid so I guess guys what uh, the message is just be careful out there and I don't know if I got scammed by um, somebody imitating Solar City or not but I'm gonna find out so um, guys just be careful and uh, 
uh, apparently it happens during the holiday season a lot. So, um, I'll, I'll follow up if the Solar City was a scam, I'll follow up, but I was pretty sure when they hit me up for that 169 that I had a zero balance with them, so if that's a scam, I'll, I'll make another video and post it. So, anyway guys, um, be careful, and because it's that time of year where they are out, and these scammers are out in, in uh, uh, triplicate, so be careful. Have a great day, guys.